Slippery roads are to blame for this wreck on Interstate 75 this morning. It happened in the northbound lanes at the West Carrollton exit. Police say the woman driving this black car slammed into the side of the semi. Fortunately, though, nobody was hurt. High winds had these trampolines doing somersaults. Mark Price sent us the photos after his neighbor's equipment blew away just north of Urbana on State Route 68. Even more dangerous, Elise Coulter joins us from Trotwood, where power lines blew down. Elise? Jack and Deborah, well, the wind has been howling all day long, and in some areas of Montgomery County, the wind gusts have actually reached up to more than 50 miles an hour. And with little to no relief to the wind, it's kept crews and neighbors busy all day long. Wow! This big tree! We surprised Cornell Anderson with some bad news. This is a big tree. I mean, it uprooted. Anderson had no idea the sound he heard. It just sounded like somebody's car backfired or someone's door was closing. That was it. And wow. Was this tree falling from the force of today's wind? I don't know what we're going to do. I really don't know. We had to get out here and cut it up. This is all that's left standing of the tree, but the homeowner tells me it was actually as tall as the one across the street. Thank God it just didn't hit the house. I'm really surprised that a pole came down like that, that easily. Joseph Braun lives just down the road from this crooked pole. His power went out around 1130 this morning, and he was driving to the gas station to fill up his generator. But he's been watching the wind whip around all morning. A lots of wind, um, lots of branches coming down, and a lot of noise. There's things moving all over the place that are shouldn't be moving. Neighbors cleaned up the tree branch that fell on the power lines, knocking down the pole. It's something that Braun says is quite common in this neighborhood. I think that's awesome, but that's not surprising. That's the way that that's the way people are here. And they just people take care of ourselves. Right now, there are 430 DPNL customers in Montgomery County without power tonight and 350 customers without power in Greene County. Now, we will keep you up to date on this situation all through the night. The wind hasn't stopped howling out here in Trotwood at all. So for now, reporting live in Trotwood, Elise Coulter, ABC 22 News.